back again with another music video reaction my name is josh thanks for checking out the channel if you click the thumbnail you're here to check out some new music at least that's what i'm doing so i've been experiencing a whole bunch of different bands and artists that you guys have told me about and one that we're going to work on today you guys have repeatedly in the comment section told me to check out avi kaplan's music uh, he was the bass singer i believe from Pentatonix, and went off to do his own thing so i was checking out his channel and he's got a good bit of stuff on there but then i came across one that i think he kind of started with Maybe when he separated from Pentatonix, I don't know. But th this one is Avriel and the Sequilas. I know I'm not saying that right. There's a lot of vowels in there. But this is Hey Ya. So this is the actual uh, cover from the Outcast song, <laughs> Hey Ya. I've not heard that song in forever, but I'm very familiar with that one. So figure we give this one a listen and see how this is. So let's go ahead and check it out. Sequilas. Sequilas? already after my heart with this old bluegrass sound.
right. So that was Hey Yad, Outcast cover. That was ridiculously good and just so much fun to hear. I mean, I know that uh, he's got some solo, solo stuff that you guys have told me to check out, which I'm going to get to shortly. But I'll be with this other group, the Sequoias. Sequoias? Whoever that is, it's just, I mean, it sounds like super bluegrassy, which I really enjoy. And I had no idea that an Outcast song could be made into a song like that and sound so good. <laughs> It actually, it was so, it fits so well. I mean, I definitely know they're talented to be able to arrange it this way and have a cover that sounds so just good. Like it was written to be sung like this or performed like this, and that's just awesome. He's got such a cool voice. This is like the first time I've heard him kind of do more than just the, the deeper part because I've mostly seen him, or I've actually only seen him in Pentatonix, where I guess he did some other singing in that too, but predominantly he was the bass, you know, low singer, which he did a little bit in this, but... He also just sings really well, and apparently he's talented enough to play the guitar and sing at the same time. And again, everybody just looks so happy. That really just made me happy. I think that's kind of the best synopsis for that video. I don't know. Let me know some more I should check out from him. I know some of the solo ones you guys have told me about, but leave the names of those in the comment section because you guys have told me a lot. So let me know the ones you guys most want me to check out, and I'll get there first. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you would. That'd be fantastic. And as always, you're awesome. Peace out. Thank you.